Today I'm here with Gigi Vorgan, who has just written a very cool book called The Naked Lady Who Stood on Her Head. What, Gigi, what is this about? This book is about a psychiatrist's most bizarre cases in it during his long career. It starts when he's young, when he's a, just starting out a, a training, you know, after his training as a psychiatrist and follows his 25-year career, so he becomes much more mature, and his diagnoses and his experience change as he grows, and it follows his life. So it's somewhat of a memoir, but it focuses on his bizarre cases, and they are bizarre. Like, give me an example of something really bizarre. Well, there is a man who believes his penis is shrinking. I thought all men believe that. I don't think so. Oh. <laughs> this guy really believes it. Oh, okay. And um, there's a woman who believes that staring into her eyes is making love to her. Whoa, so it's a very sexual book. Well, those are the two sexual oh. ones. <laughs> um, you know, I'm going to read it now. People, Guys, goodbye. I'm going to read the book. People have sex, and um, they tend to talk about it with their shrinks. Um, there's also a story about a carpenter who enters his left hand over and over and it comes to pass that Gary discovers he wants his left hand amputated. Whoa. So he needs to have some help and Gary help. Gary, by the way, is my co-writer, Dr. Gary Small, and he also happens to be my husband. Well, that's convenient. And we've written five books together. This is our fifth book. And it's out just yesterday from HarperCollins. Go HarperCollins! the Morrow Division, and um, the cases are very strange. Let me ask you a question, because I, you know, I think a lot of my, my readers, or, or I, I'm not saying they all do, but my guess is many have shrinks, um, do, not to scare people that they're going to go to the shrink today, and maybe they're worried their penis is shrinking, and that they're afraid their, their shrink's going to then write a book, are people going to read this book and know that this is them, and, and no, their shrinking absolutely penis? absolutely not. Oh, okay. The cases are disguised, changed, so well, I don't think anybody's going to recognize them. And if they did, if they, I don't think the guy who thought his penis was shrinking is going to run up and say, that's me, that's me, I, thought, I think my penis is shrinking. Also, this book gives you a, v a view of psychiatry that you probably haven't had before. Even if you've been going to a psychiatrist for years, it, makes you, it gives you that fly on the wall kind of view where you're kind of in the shrink's head. You, listen the way he listens. You understand his point of view and you kind of feel his feelings and you understand his thoughts when he hears the case. And you kind of diagnose with him, the patient. It's, it's very interesting. It sounds fascinating. It also sounds like it could be a reality show. Well, you never know. Well, I can't wait to read it because I, I would love to be a fly on the wall in the psychiatrist's office. And so I suggest everyone go out and get the, the lady the who's naked lady. Naked lady who stood on well, she was she didn't think anything was shrinking? No, she oh, didn't oh. she <laughs> didn't have a shrinking problem at all. <laughs> the naked lady who stood on her head, a psychiatrist's stories of his most bizarre cases. Thank you, Gigi Morgan. Thank you.